Hello, welcome to my channel, and today we're going to kick off the uh, upgrade series to my Axial Yeti. Um, there hasn't been much done to this Axial Yeti yet. Uh, it, it basically is the kit form of the Axial Yeti that comes with some upgrade parts, such as these linked braces right here for the trailing arms. And it also comes with... Uh, different steering links up here um, so there will be a few things that I'll be changing out so far the only upgrades that I have been done to this truck are uh, crawler innovation uh, deuces wild foams for the stock Falcon Wild Peak wheels uh, they're single stage foams so it'll enable it to handle at high speeds without uh, rolling over as easily And the truck is be currently powered by uh, a 10 shock SC411 4600 kV four pole motor. Uh, it's a short, short course truck motor by 10 shock. And the ESC is a Hobby Wing um, SCT8 Pro, also a short, cor uh, short course uh, truck. Uh, ESC. Um, so, other than that, there it's got a Savox servo. Uh, I believe I am running the 1268 SG servo. You can see right there. And other than that, there hasn't been much done to this truck yet. So, a few things that we're going to be looking at um, are strengthening. Or these are already strengthened, but I would like to use uh, even better trailing arms, stronger trailing arms. Um, these upper links right here are, let's see if you can take a look there, these are still plastic and still flimsy, so these will be replaced as well. Um, I do have RPM arms to replace these uh, plastic arms here. Uh, I will look into putting a hinge sleeve here to strengthen that hinge pin as well and I do have uh, we also want to upgrade this piece right here to prevent the hinge pin from getting impacted now I am also looking at the drive shaft here the stock drive shaft here which is not bad but uh, this will be probably swapped out for the MIP drive shaft Other things that we're going to be looking at, um, here we're using the stock AR60 rear axle and we will, I will probably be looking at swapping this out for the uh, SSD HD60 centered rear axle um, so that we can kind of center the drive shaft and kind of limit the torque twist on this truck. All right, with the uh, body off the truck, um, another upgrade that has been done so far are the axial blue springs, and these are the uh, the stiffest springs that you could get for the Yeti. So these are the axial blue springs on both the front and the rear, and the weight of oil that I'm using is. I believe uh, 50 weight in the front and 40 weight in the back. All right, so um, this will be a multi-part series and we will uh, go through each of these upgrade steps one video at a time. Thanks for watching.